All right, we're going to quickly troubleshoot a bulk insert issue uh, or bulk insert error, I should say. When you get the error message, message 4863 level 16 state 1 line 1, and you'll see bulk load data conversion error truncation for row, and there's usually a number, column, there's usually a number. Okay, so let's just see what this error is. First, we're going to create a table called the error table. Well, actually, it already exists. Let's drop the table. And we are going to, we are going to bulk insert a savings rate file, this file right here. So just to take a look at this file and then see we have some data here. Now you'll notice, look at those columns, varcar5, varcar5. And when you saw the file, doesn't really look like it's a 5, right? It looks like it's more closer to... 20 or 25. So let's go ahead and bulk insert, right? And you'll see it failed. It failed across the board. And we'll go ahead and drop the table. So it's varcar5, right? Let's go to 25 and create the table. And see what happens. Oops. I like the whole thing. And there you go. So basically what that error indicates is that one of your columns is not large enough. Anytime you see anything involving truncation, um, last night actually, or two nights ago, I ran into the same issue. We were rolling out connection strings and the connection string field was 200 varcar. Uh, and the connection string we were rolling out was about 222. And we got a similar error. So. Always make sure that your columns are large enough in terms of size right here to fit the data. Again, when you clean data, you can narrow it down. But when you're importing data into a staging table, you want that staging table to be very large fields. My staging tables are usually VARCAR 500 because I want to accept everything and then spit the data that I don't want out. Uh, but I don't want to see those errors. So that's what that means. Any type of truncation means basically one of your columns too small. What you want to do is look at the error. Uh, for instance, it'll say for row, let's say it was row 500. That means that 500th row in that file is too big for the column. And then it'll say which column. So that'll help point you in the right direction.